This was possibly one of the most beautiful films of the year. This new indie film is called Past Lives. I really feel like everyone can somewhat relate to this film. First of all, it was created by A24 Productions, the same people who came up with everything, everywhere, all at once, beef, and a bunch of other great films and TV shows. At the same time, I think this film came out at the perfect time. I think people are going through this superhero movie fatigue where we're sort of sick of all the superpowers, big explosions, big everything that we can't really ever re relate to that much. On the other hand, this film I feel like was very, very down to earth, very relatable. I feel like almost everyone could relate to one of the very few characters in this movie. It definitely had that perfect indie film vibe and reminded me a lot of that Jim Carrey independent film, Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind, and in fact, they even reference that movie in Past Lives. Without spoilers, Past Lives is about both the metaphoric and literal meaning of that title, where things from your life, from, from the past, came back, while at the same time there is a metaphoric part to it, but they'll explain that in the movie. I felt like this movie was more relatable to me because I myself moved around a lot, so each time I moved I had a different group of people I would relate to and, and be friends with and have relationships with. And sometimes there's some intersections between those lives that come together and you just don't really know what to expect from that. So this film is pretty much about a childhood love that never came to fruition. And what I really liked about this movie was how gentle they were at telling the story. Everything really felt like I that, that could be me. One of those characters could be me. Everything about this film, from the cinematography, the camera work, the story, the acting, was just beautiful. Highly, highly recommend that you check out this film. In fact, it has quite a big following overseas already. And fortunately, our friends from Cinema 76 are bringing this to the Philippines. It will be showing at a few other theaters, but Cinema 76 are the people bringing it in. And I do love watching movies there, so do check them out. The, the micro cinema called Cinema 76.